Hi, good day. Welcome to my English Tan class. My name is Teacher Joanne Rojas. Are you ready to learn? The learning competency that we are about to tackle is use information from informative talks in everyday life. This is based from the most essential learning competencies. What are the specific learning objectives? First, figure out the importance of informative talk in everyday life. Second, identify the nature of informative talk. Third, Record an informative talk through a video. The first question that we need to answer is how can we use information from informative talk in everyday life? To answer the question, let us assume that I am a very important invited speaker of a certain event. I will be talking about COVID-19. Good day. At the end of 2019, a new type of coronavirus began making people sick with flu-like symptoms. The illness is called coronavirus disease or COVID-19 in short. The virus spreads easily and has now affected people in many countries. COVID-19 causes a fever, cough, and trouble breathing. Some people might have a sore throat chills, repeated shaking with chills, muscle pain, headache, a loss of taste or smell. People can catch coronavirus from others who have the virus. This happens when an infected person sneezes or coughs, sending tiny droplets into the air. These can land in the nose, mouth, or eyes of someone nearby or be breathed in. People also can be infected if they touch an infected droplet on a surface and then touch their own nose, mouth, or eyes. Thank you very much for listening. Based from that informative talk, how can we use the information in everyday life? Well, as concerned citizens, the informative talk gives us the information about COVID-19. It educates us how COVID-19 spreads. It also reminds us to observe the health and safety protocols. So, informative talks are very important because these would educate and guide us to do what we should need to do. So, as responsible citizens, we have to help and spreading the information to the public. Purposely, we can help our government as well. So, why do we need to listen to informative talks? Definitely, the very purpose 
of listening to informative talks is for us to be informed. Informative talks are definitely taken from informative texts. Informative text focuses on defining terms, giving details, explaining terms, highlighting facts, and elaborating facts. When someone talks about a topic that emphasizes a certain issue, purposely to inform the reader or listener, we call that as an informative talk. An informative talk is taken from an informative essay. Drafting a well-researched informative essay is very important in preparing a comprehensive informative talk. How do we write an informative text or essay in order to come up with a comprehensive informative talk? How do we write an informative essay? First is choose a topic. The topic that we need to choose is the latest topic, the latest issue that everyone can relate. Next is write a thesis statement. In writing a thesis statement, this refers to a very strong statement that summarizes the entire essay. Next, draft the outline. In drafting the outline, we will consider, of course, the introduction, the body paragraphs, and the conclusion. In writing the introduction, the main topic and the thesis statement are present. In writing the body paragraphs, specific details or supporting details should somehow help in elaborating the main topic or the main topic of the essay. Next is writing the conclusion. In writing the conclusion, you need to mention again the thesis statement before you end the essay. Writing an informative essay takes time. It needs thorough research in order to come up with a very comprehensive output. Are you ready to come up with an informative talk? This time, you are to write a short informative essay explaining about the topic, Coping and Managing Depression Due to COVID-19. See to it that you will research further so that you can come up with good explanation about the topic. Next, you need to record a video to come up with a comprehensive informative talk. This may be done memorizing the essay or you can glance once in a while while you are delivering the informative talk. See to it that the talk covers coping and managing depression due to COVID-19. Once you are ready, you upload the video on our Facebook Classroom. For those students who do not have cell phones and access to the internet, 
you don't have to worry. I will schedule a home visitation. Thank you very much for watching. Always believe that together we can still learn despite the threat of COVID-19.